It's a beautiful poem by Thomas More, and it's called The Meeting of the Waters. There is not in the wide world a valley so sweet as that veil in whose bosom the bright waters meet. All the last rays of feeling and life must depart ere the bloom of that valley shall fade from my heart. Yet it was not that nature had shed o'er the scene, her purest of crystal and brightest of green. T'was not her soft magic of streamlet or hill, oh no, it was something more exquisite still. Was that friends the beloved of my bosom were near, who made every dear scene of enchantment more dear, and who felt how the best charms of nature improve when we see them reflected from looks that we love. Sweet veil of Advoca, how calm could I rest in thy bosom of shade with the friends I love best, where the storms that we feel in this cold world should cease, and our hearts like the waters be mingled in peace. Today I'd like to sing an Irish song that tells about the meeting of the waters, three rivers in the village of Avoca in County Wicklow, Ireland. The song is called The Sweet Vale of Avoca. I only learned it about 10 minutes ago and I'm back this morning by Our Lady's Choral Society. So this is Bill's version. There is not in the wide world a valley so sweet as the veil in whose bosom the bright waters meet. Oh, the last rays of feeling and life must be born. The bloom of that happy shall fade from my heart. Ere the bloom of that happy shall fade from my heart. Yeah. It was not the nature that shed o'er the sea. Her purest of crystal and brightest of green. T'was not a soft magic of streamlet or hill. Oh no, it was something. More exquisite still, oh no, it was something more exquisite still. T'was the friends the beloved of my bosom were me, who made every dear scene of more dear and who felt that the best chance of nature improve when we 